at least it's sunny. It's been fantastic today. How have you enjoyed Truck Fest? You had a decent day? Amazing. I love it. I absolutely love it. I'm going to stay on for a little bit longer. Even This is my last gig here, but I'm going to stay on and watch the Monster Choice. Yeah, do. If you've not seen it before, it's a real spectacle. And the thing is, what they tend to do on the very last show on the last day, they tend to give it some because they've got nothing left to lose. You know, They know there's no more shows, so they tend to give it full bore. And actually, they, they get some terrific hype. So, um, how's things been for you then? I mean, this character of yours, he's been hugely popular, hasn't he? Yeah, yeah, popular, controversial at first. Uh, I think the controversy was over the Tash, my uh, flavor saver. I don't think that was on a, I think that split the nation, but uh, eventually people got used to it. And the character himself is a few chips short of a Happy Meal, but people seem to like him, you know? He's, um, he couldn't really do any wrong, and I, I appreciate that, so thank you. There's something about playing a, a bad boy, though, isn't it? It's like a challenge for an actor. Yeah, it's fun. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you get away with a lot of things, you know? I can get away with a lot of things anyway. It was, uh, it's weird, I always I always wanted to do acting since I was a kid. I always wanted to play the hero, like in Rocky, when I saw it when I was, I don't know, 10 years of age. And the irony is I get, I keep getting cast as the bad guy. So I'm the Dolph Lundgren in everything that I do, really, at this moment. And on the subject of bad guys, that was the whole reason these people